because it is October 1st, today I will be showing you guys how I decorate for fall slash Halloween. I, these decorations are up until like the end, ends of November um, when I start decorating for Christmas. And yes, I do decorate. Um, I do have things around my room already because these are things that I've had in the past um, for like a year or two. So I don't know if you'll be able to find them in stores, but they are common enough where you could find similar stuff too. And then I will be showing you guys where I will be placing some of the recent things that I bought. Um, and all the things that I like I have aren't expensive. So it is on the cheap side, but you can make things pretty with cheap. <laughs> All right, so I'm first gonna tell you what I have up. Um, some of the things I do have up are lights, so you won't be able to tell that they're there, but I will be showing you guys how it looks at night when the sun goes down at the end where I show like the whole room. Right, so this is my bookshelf. Um, and this is here all year round, but I don't really turn them on um, until like the holidays. But I have these lights that are just white and that I bought at Target. Um, and they make the bookshelf look nice, so that's why I have them there. And this is my mirror. Um, I have put some lights around there. Uh, they're white as well. And I hide them behind the door. So I tuck in the light um, wires at the bottom and then I tape the battery box behind the door so you can't tell that it's there but you can obviously tell that the lights are there but I don't mind that um, if you do then I wouldn't recommend doing this my desk is the next thing that's decorated the light is there all year round but the things around it aren't um, the blue sign I have recently bought at Target so that's still there and I believe it was three dollars um, the cat chalkboard i also got at target last last year and the little halloween pumpkins i bought at dollar tree for a dollar the cat says the moon made me do it just because i like the saying i usually have a count down there but i never keep track of it so i decided not to do that this year on this side i have my calendar which is also there all the time but the pumpkin isn't um, there is a light in the pumpkin, which I think you could tell. It turns red or orange, but I usually have it in the orange setting. Um, I got it at Michael's last year. It was around $10, I believe. And it was when it was on clearance because it was the end of Halloween already. Okay, this is the main thing you see when you enter my room. It is the leaves and the banner. The leaves I got at Dollar Tree and I just separated them myself and taped them up on the wall, which you could tell a little bit, but again, I don't mind. And the banner I got at Target. The clip hanger things and the string aren't part of the pumpkins. Uh, those come separately, but uh, the pumpkins were only $3 and the string and hangers, I don't know because I had already. The next decoration that I have and have always put are these leaves on the headboard. They were purchased at Dollar Tree um, and I have them on both ends of the bed. I think they look really nice because they stand out with the white. The last thing that I already had were these little Halloween uh, lights. They light up orange and they are in the shape of a pumpkin which is really cute. And under there, I don't know if you could tell a little silver, there is another light set that lights up orange as well, but a little, a much brighter orange. And they were purchased at Target. Okay, so I went to the 99 cent store and I bought a couple of things that were a dollar. There were just a few, but I thought they would make the room look better. I will be putting the orange leaves and cutting the little flowers from the stems and putting them around the bookshelf where the lights are and then the pumpkins and the ribbons i will be putting it in the refrigerator that i do have in my room okay this is what the bookshelf looks like with the leaves and flowers 
I'm not sure if I like it or not because it doesn't really combine or it just stands out like a lot. I might take it off, but I'm not sure yet. And here is a fridge section. I have some white lights around the fridge as well, but they have always been there. I just added the ribbon and the little pumpkins. All right, that's how I decorate. It seems excessive, honestly, but I love decorating for the holidays. It just, it makes my room lively, if that makes sense. Um, and it's nice to like open the door too. Once again, I'm like, I keep on staring at the bookshelf just because I don't know if I like it or not. Like, I think I'm gonna keep it for a day or two. And it's, it seems like a lot, like it's just too much in your face kind of thing. But I'm again, I'm gonna keep it for a day or two and see if it like warms up to me. <laughs> That's how I decorate for fall. Again, I will be showing you guys what it looks like with the lights on when it gets dark just because it's not dark yet yeah i'll see you guys in another video